Hi guys, um, I'm doing an update on the Speedy Bandelier review I did. I got a couple of requests to compare the monogram to the Damiea bin. Uh, so I'm going to do a comparison side by side and show you some close-ups. Hang on. Okay, so here they are side by side. Same size, not much difference. This is the end view. The ring and the clip. I don't know if you can read very well that it they're two different colors. And on the monogram, closer in color. The new stamp, Louis Vuitton Paris on this one. This one's made in the USA. This one's also made in the USA, but it has the stamp made in USA. Um, some of you may have seen some how to spot a fake videos out there, and they tell you how many stitches, um, uh, stitches, number of stitches can tell you a fake. Um, it's different on the monogram versus the Damier Ben. On the Speedy in monogram, there are five stitches across the top and four stitches down this way and another five this way. Now that's not true on the Damier Ben, so hold on and I'll show you on that one. On the Damier Ben, it's different. It's six across the top here five down and seven diagonally so that's different than the monogram so you can't go by that um, how to spot a fake video that they tell you to count stitches five across four down so that doesn't work on the Damier pen. Another thing I've noticed look at the gap in the end of the zipper on the Damier pen. Hang on I'll show you the monogram you see on the monogram there's not a gap where you can see the interior of the bag and it's the same on both ends um, on the monogram and there's an opening on both ends of the Damier bin. So just a quick modeling shot for both of them to show you. I'm not going to put both straps in so just on the shortest straps for both of them. So. So I heard uh, from a couple of viewers, and it kind of confirmed what I suspected. Um, the new stamp, Louis Vuitton Paris, which they said all bags would go to that, um, that they wouldn't say where they were made. Um, this is a brand new bag, the Damier Ben uh, Speedy Bandelier. So you would think that they would put that stamp on all the bags if they were really going to go to that. But only the bags that are made in the USA seem to have that stamp. Uh, several viewers have gotten this brand new bag and it has the Made in France stamp on it um, in Europe. So I think that that stamp, um, which I suspected, is just for the USA consumer, which um, I don't appreciate. Um, I think it shows a disregard for the US consumer. Um, they're trying to avoid uh, the consumers looking for a Made in France bag, but I think that's just going to backfire because then people are going to know that there's a bag out there that does say made in France so they're going to pursue it even more so um, I think this is going to work against Louis Vuitton so we'll see how that goes um, even with the changes in the bag I still like the bag I still would have bought it um, I do have a couple of other bags that I I do want but at this point um, if they have that stupid tag in it I'm probably not going to buy it I would look for pre-loved so 
we'll see. Um, time to move on to maybe another designer. I do love Louis Vuitton, but like I say, prices go up two, three times a year. Quality's going down, so we'll see. Like I say, I have a couple more bags. We'll see if they end up in the collection or not. So hopefully this, this was helpful. Um, thanks. Have a great week.